back at it with a knife comparison. Here we've got a $13 gas station knife. And this is a $200 Spyderco Para 3 in Maximum. So this flea market knife is still pretty sharp, as well as the Spyderco Para 3. But you gotta realize that there are two different blade properties. This was made in China and they don't even mark what type of steel it is. Whereas this was made here in the USA. And of course it's Maximus steel. So the better question is which one is gonna be able to retain an edge? So what edge retention is, is how many times can you cut a box until it goes dull? An unmarked steel like this one will probably go dull after cutting 50 of these boxes. Whereas Maximus steel could probably go through tens of thousands of these boxes before it even comes close to losing the edge. So would you rather spend $200 on this bad boy and only have to sharpen it every year? Or would you rather have one of these knives for $13 and have to sharpen it every day? Share this with the buddy that carries a knife.